How's it going YouTube and welcome back agents. Today's simulation is my first full game of Assassinate and look who it decides to pit me against. I ate your face. Now I've played this player a whole bunch of times in Revelations and they relied on their smoke far too much in that game. Um, but We'll see just how well relying on smoke bomb is going to be for them in this game. So the reason why I want to bring this to you today is because it's the first, first uh, full game of Assassinate that I actually played. Um, obviously I still had to get used to the new mechanics and having to play with a default set. So really and truly I'm only playing with knives and that's it. So. At the start, I wasn't aware of which player it was in the blend group, I had no idea. And here I've still got no idea, I know somebody's just died. I've been locked, so it's like, right, back off. Like, try and figure out who it is. And it's I ate your face. Um, I guess he's being chased by somebody else, so... Yeah, it looks like it might be... The Carpenter, I think his name is, so... We're going to try and kill him. But it turns out to be unsuccessful. So we're going to drop the lock and look out for I ate your face. Now, um, corner stun. Ooh, nice. Uh, one thing I will point out is in Assassinate, if you're not already aware, is that um, there is still the high profile prioritization for the lock. So if you want to lock onto somebody, uh, a specific player in specific how many times can I say specific in one sentence uh, you need to open the precision lock so you can see prior to me killing the um, uh, Pocahontas I struggled to actually lock the guy on the floor so that's a tip for you um, so yeah not long ago finished work and um, I thought I would make a commentary for you guys because it's been a few days since I made one um, and I don't want this well I don't want to start filling up my hard drive with um, lots of videos waiting to be uploaded so I thought I would take the opportunity to now make a video for you and here it is so Uh, yeah, so we're playing as the robber, my brand favourite character. And yesterday I was actually playing um, Wolfpack to try and unlock some of the dark costumes for each of the characters. And I tell you what, that is so much fun. I was playing it um, alone because I thought, well, I watched a video from somebody that I'm, subs that I'm subscribed to and. They made it look pretty easy, so to be honest, I was like, well, if they can do it, I can do it. And within about two hours, I blitzed each of the characters and all of the maps and got everybody's dark costume uh, unlocked. So, here is a reference to my previous video. This guy tried to knife stun me, but he unlocked me too late. So I taunted him, and in the next or at least in the next minute he's going to come back and he's going to taunt me and it's the taunt this um, play, the character has is actually pretty funny so sorry Pocahontas we're going to have to uh, visit the dentist and get some brand new teeth so we're going to wait for our silent to build up get a focus and here is I ate your face dead I salute you that made me laugh so much, it was fucking hilarious. So you can see he's level 47 and I'm maybe level 13, I'm not sure. Um, I haven't had the best starts to this game. Obviously I'm still used to running around and being able to control the one of the camera sticks without having to press sprint with your thumb, so it's actually quite difficult. And here are Duke. I ate a face out of his smoke bomb, so he's pretty screwed. And look, he's going to. Oh, what's that? He's running away. 
from his target because he can't rely on his OP smoke bomb. So it just goes to show how this game has really nerfed players like that and that playstyle. So I'm sorry, I ate your face. If you ever watch this, it's not a this isn't a dig at your playstyle. It's just a dig at how Revelations was made to be honest and the lack of support it was given for patches post release and something else I've learned is to if you're gonna get um, chase killed by one of the noobs is to not bother throwing your knife just take your, t your contested kill and um, come back to it later on because you will it's a 60 second cooldown I believe I'm not sure so, Pocahontas just killed a civilian and she's going to run away. I'm going to chase after her. And she locks me first and inadvertently starts an escape, so, or a chase even. So I'm going to try and get an out of sight escape, but take a corner stun instead. And um, I locked the bear first because I knew this grounded Pocahontas bitch wouldn't be able to interact with me for a while and I didn't anticipate what just happened but I got poisoned and ugh, <laughs> that was pretty hilarious at the time I was like whoa what happened there so we now know that I-80 face is using smoke poison knives which uh, after having played a fair number of sessions now is the set of choice for a lot of players um, Obviously not noobs because you're not at a certain level to unlock or that sort of stuff yet, but somebody posted on one of my videos, uh, not my, one of my videos, my previous video about um, being able to knife stun. So if they lock you first, um, you need to be a good distance away from them at least uh, three times the kill range before you well, why, as you throw your knives, because if you throw your knives and they're within at least two times kill range, they are going to run at, they're going to get to you before the knives take effect. So bear that in mind if you're going to, when you throw your knives. But when you're going in for the stun, try to run or try to approach them quickly so that you're outside of your outside of their kill range before you attempt the stun because. If you get too close, they you just end up contesting their kill. Um, and I really thought I could lock Pocahontas first, but it turns out that in your first full game of Assassinate, when you're not used to the new mechanics, you can't. Because you're still used to the um, quick lock in Ace, the ACR quick lock, yeah. So, so yeah, with knife stuns, you just it's just practice. So to, to whoever that was, I hope uh, the tip I gave you worked. Excuse me. I actually tried to run up the wall there to get an acrobatic, but it didn't allow me to run up. So I guess I wasn't in line to grab hold of that post that you could see. So what we've got two minutes to go. Uh, next target is the bear because he's just killed a Pocahontas. That wasn't very nice. He's now dead. So next target. is I ate your face. No, nope, he's dead. So we're going to kill the carpenter. Um, I'm getting used to the characters a bit more. I think the robber, uh, Pocahontas, the preacher. Um, I'm not sure about any of the others. They, Those three look like good characters. Um, I wish I had the sharpshooter because he looks badass like Clint Eastwood style you know Dirty Harry sort of thing um, and with his dark costume version he looks even more badass and I just got extreme variety in my first full game of assassinate which at the time I didn't realize I only saw the 1100 points come up for the kill I was like what the hell oh lag killed or well, actually I was the, well, probably the one lagging because it looks like she's the host because she, she's got green ping. So, 
That's something as well you want to bear in mind is the ping that you've got. Because right here, you're going to see some bullshittery. So I vulture the bear. I try to lock Pocahontas, but she gets a naked stun before my lock processes, so... For her, obviously, it processed quicker than it did for me, so she was able to get the stun. But yeah, we've broken 10k in our first full game against a over-reliant smoke noob in ACR. And here he is at the end. I'm going to rush kill him for a reckless kill. And we're going to make him leave the game. I don't know why he left. He lost out on XP for that. Which would have uh, gone towards him ranking up. So yeah, that is my first full game of Assassinate on AC3. Um, so let me know in the comments if you want to see some more Assassinate. Because I will be playing as many games as I can. Once I beat single player, which is my next uh, target for today. Got nothing left to do, so... Hope you guys enjoyed this, and I'll catch you later, YouTube.